Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I hope the channel finds you guys safe and well. A poll that basically agrees completely with Pierce Morgan has been released and the public do feel that the royal couple are literally cashing in on their royal titles. Without the titles, and I've always said it, these pair would simply be just another pair of celebrities in Los Angeles, milling their way around and basically getting on with it. But because they have these titles, they are given exceptional attention and the opportunity to make vast amounts of money. They have revealed that the first series they will be doing for Netflix involves the Invictus Games. They will now be cashing in on the veterans although they state any money made from the first series will go back into the invictus games it does remain to be seen we do know that these two tend to exploit every situation when the poll asked do you agree harry and Meghan are cashing in on their royal titles, the survey showed a staggering 90% of 14,800 people agreed that Harry and Meghan were cashing in on their royal titles. Just 3% disagreed with Mr. Morgan's position. And let's face it, when Harry and Meghan sat down for that bombshell interview with Oprah, Meghan stated that the palace did not give her help for her suicidal thoughts and they told her that it wouldn't look good and she was basically brushed aside. She also claimed that a royal senior member of the family was racist towards her and making suggestions about how dark Archie would be. And then there was the claim from Harry that when he left the royal fold, he only had the income which his mother had left him. He did not mention his great-grandmother, the Queen's mother's money, that had been left to him in trust. He didn't talk about that at all. Someone has suggested, and this has been an insider, without their titles, they would just be another so-called celebrity couple in Los Angeles, which I've stated, and good luck to them, as long as they stay in the United States and do not come back to the UK. That is how people really do feel about Harry and Meghan. Some have suggested that what would happen to them if the Queen decided to basically revoke their titles. It's worth thinking about, someone else has said. Now, they claim that the royal family are extremely toxic. They also claim that Prince William, the Duke of Cambridge, and Charles... Prince Charles, the Duchy of Cornwall, are trapped. They are trapped in their roles and that the royal family itself is toxic. Yet, they continually talk about the royal family, arguably the most famous family in the world, in order, as I've stated in previous videos, to get attention and maximum attention, the pair are now both infamous and they are racking up and making million dollar deals in their sleep, a hundred million dollar deals. And they've done all of this during a worldwide global pandemic. Guys, as I always say, tell me what you think, like, comment, and subscribe because I think these conversations are simply not going to go away because while they pronounce that the royal family is a toxic family they continue to cash in and now the pair of them are cashing in on veterans for their next flick deal in my opinion personally 
I think it's pretty disgusting. Like, comment and subscribe as always. Bye for now.